Look, another story on the front of the Indeed. Australian tomorrow. Blackout and supply fears from new Snowy 2.0 delay. A new two-year delay to the federal government's $5.9 billion Snowy 2.0 has prompted fresh fears of supply shortfalls, price surges and blackouts. Lise, I mean... We cannot get energy policy or infrastructure right in this country. Do you think that the, this mm. now... I mean, I know yep. that the government were quick to point out that, you know, and the coalition were bleating about it today. Um, but where, do, where does the government go from here? Because this project has just had so many cost blowouts, uh, timeline blowouts, as big infrastructure projects do. But where to from here? Mm. Well, you remember when Turnbull announced it, he was spruiking that it would be $2 billion and now the projections <laughs> are that it will hit $10 billion, and that's a conservative blowout. Yeah. So, And we're not going to see this possibly operation until 2029. So really, that's a, a long-term problem that's just going to keep growing in cost for us. But mm. what the government needs to focus on now, and it's what you spoke about before, is the real risk of blackouts and how we're going to get through this coming winter. Because, mm. you know, we were already seeing you, you've had Liddell close, you've got immense pressure on the electricity grid as it is, and you seem to have this real strong anti-coal, anti-gas mentality when mm. we need that fossil fuel to keep our lights on. So, mm. look, you talk about the rising cost of living. Electricity bills, it's a common conversation now when you're sitting amongst a group of people where mm. people who have uh, solar panels on their roof are talking about what their electricity bill is compared to those who don't. So... Yeah. Electricity is a big issue. And, look, I know here in Queensland the Premier was talking about a potential $175 sort of rebate or handout mm. uh, when they bring down their budget. I think it's in June. But mm. it'll be interesting to see if there is anything at all in this coming budget next week. Yeah, I think the other, hence why we saw Danny Landro is going so hard uh, today, but that's a story for another time. Yeah.